All right, so the four integrations I wanna talk about today are Sonos integrated with your iPhone, Sonos integrated with Amazon devices called Alexa, Apple TV, which is my favorite, and finally, the watch, okay? So we're gonna get into all that. All right, so before we get into the integrations, I wanna quickly go over what sort of system do I have? So I have two, two, I have two amps, okay? And they power two different zones, okay? So the first zone is in here. So I have a speaker here, 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 and here. And this is powered by one Sonos amp. This is called the Kitchen Sonos. And then we have an outdoor Sonos system. So we have a speaker here, a speaker here. Visual. All right, these so are the two amps. So each one of these represents a different zone. So one's for the kitchen, one is for the outdoor. Each speaker has a wire running from it to its respective amp. If you wanna know how to set this up, I'll put the link to those videos at the end of the video. So if you wanna do this in your own house, you wanna install these speakers, you'll know how to do it. So let's start with the iPhone integration. So the first thing you need to do obviously is have the Sonos app downloaded. And Sonos actually has a radio, but I like to use Spotify for my music. So if I just start off the Spotify app on my phone, I just, you're playing it, right? And you can easily hit this button right here, kind of a speaker button. And what I could do is I can pick the Kitchen Sonos and it starts playing. Now let's say I wanna play it outside as well. What I can do is open up my Sonos app. I click on the Spotify thing that we're playing and you just enable the other zone, okay? So now what I have is basically I have music playing all over the place, okay? So that's pretty cool with the iPhone, but it's not, it's not groundbreaking. iPhone integration works really well, okay? The next thing we're gonna do is show you the Amazon integration. This is a show. Um, this is a, basically an Alexa device. All right. So this works pretty well with the Sonos, but there is some issues with it. So I'm going to show you. Um, so if I just say, Alexa, play Spotify on the kitchen Sonos. Play a radio from Spotify. Playing on kitchen Sonos. All right. So it starts playing. The weird thing about it is there's no way, because this is a nice touch screen device, to see what's playing. Like once it plays, it throws it out there into the internet. It's great because it just plays, but it's really then difficult to control it. I tried to download the Spotify on here, tried to let download Amazon, I'm sorry, uh, Sonos. It doesn't work. To enable this, you actually need to use the Alexa app on your phone and download the Sonos skill through the Alexa app and then link it. Alexa, increase the kitchen Sonos volume. Okay, that works. Alexa, stop playing music on the kitchen Sonos. I just would think, I think it'd be really cool if they could integrate it somehow into this show since this is a nice big screen. So let's move on to the next one and my most favorite, Apple TV. Okay, so imagine you have a sports game on and you have a bunch of people in your kitchen, you have a bunch of people outside, you have a game up here and you kind of just want the sound to be everywhere. All right, this is what I really like to do. So let's say we're watching the Phillies. I don't have a soundbar yet. I'm gonna be installing a Sonos soundbar. So I have the sound coming off the of TV. But what I really like is I can actually, through AirPlay, put the sound from the TV into the kitchen and out here. So let me show you that. So the first thing you need to do, always need to go into the home screen. For some reason, if you're watching something, you try to activate the speakers, it doesn't work, okay? So go to the home screen, long hold the home button. And what you wanna do is go to audio. Since the Sonos is already activated with AirPlay, this should automatically come up. There's nothing really that you have to do here. But what I can do here is I can activate the kitchen Sonos and the pool Sonos. So I'll do that here. And you can individually control the volume. Now I can go back to the home and I can go back to watching my game. So now we got the sound in the kitchen through all the speakers. And we got the sound and I got the sound out here too. I love it. So you're coming in and out of house. You got the game on. And you got the sound everywhere. So I really like it. And again, I can control everything from the TV or right from the app. So I can turn it off, turn it up. Right. So let's go back inside. All right. So I will admit it is a little clunky sometimes. It doesn't always work on here, but you can turn it off. Right now, I just go back to the normal TV speakers, okay? Now let's do the last one, which is the watch. All right, so for the watch, now I am inside, but I'll tell you the watch is very nice when you're outside, especially when you're like in a pool. You don't need to grab your phone and you, you can swim with your watch and you control your system. So let me show you how it works, all right? So let me just activate it, uh, play some music 
on these speakers. Okay, so I'm just going to my Spotify app like I did before, and I'm just gonna play music here. And then I'm gonna move it up here. All right. Now that music is playing here, now let's say I'm getting in trouble because it's too loud. I can bring this up. And I can use this app down here and turns it down. See that? Turns it up. All right, turn it down. We can even skip the song. I can skip the song again. All right, and there's some other features. You could change the song once it's playing, right? So you can really play with this. I can actually activate the outside speakers if I want to. You can control the entire Sonos ecosystem with the watch, which I really love. It's, it's actually my favorite. I didn't even know you could do that. With all that, um, I am expanding my Sonos system. I am getting a sound bar in a few weeks. I'm gonna make a video on how to install that. We're also gonna be adding Sonos out by the pool. Gonna make a full video on that. That'll probably be in the summer, okay? If you're interested in that kind of thing, maybe hit that subscribe button, all right? I'll also put a link to all the stuff, all the speakers that I have. I'll put all that in down in the description below. Um, I'll also link the videos on how to install all this stuff right here, okay? But I'm Mike, Family DIY TV. Please give me a like. Please visit www.familydiytv.com and I'm out. Hi. Sonos, not true, that's not what I'm gonna do. System, nah, not what I'm gonna do. TV. Hi, this is Mike, Family DIY TV. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I don't know, I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Can I? I seriously I don't know what, yeah. It,